Hey friends, we're going to go over how to journal, um, and specifically we're going to journal your time in classroom activities. So you're in the journal tab, you're going to go here to time in classroom activities. You're going to set the date to whatever day you actually did the assignment. Uh, so say we did an assignment in class on September 10th, I'm going to select that. Uh, over here in the category, it should automatically be in the right category, course-related activity. If for some reason you clicked on the wrong journal activity and you need to go somewhere else, you can change it in here, but for right now we're in the right place. Uh, you're going to choose the class. So we did this in intro. Uh, if your teacher has loaded units or topics, they'll pop up here. Uh, so we're going to say that this was uh, a careers activity that we did. We're going to put it in um, for activity or level. You're going to name it. So this is going to be career exploration. Um, we did an activity and then description reflection, um, a career um, exploration activity. So I learned about different careers in agriculture. I explored by watching videos and reading descriptions and then maybe just like something you liked. I liked being able to learn about new things. Okay, and then uh, don't forget to check your spelling, do that. How long did it take us? Um, it took me about 45 minutes to finish this activity. And then this last one is a mastery level. How comfortable you feel after you did this activity. Um, I cannot do this activity. I do not understand this concept. So basically you turned it in and you didn't really understand what happened. I can do this activity with help. I have some understanding of this concept. So you did it, but you had some questions for the teacher uh, and they helped you with that. And then you could turn it in. Or I can do this activity by myself. I completely understand this concept. So I did this. I didn't need any help from the teacher. I didn't need any help from my peers. I was golden. Okay, so you slide somewhere in between there so that your teacher knows what's going on. And then you hit save. Easy as that.